What is going on, YouTube? This is the white guy with some more Unleashed today. There's going to be lots of Unleashed because I've, I've gotten so many custom tracks and playing the shows. Having a lot of fun with this. Let me know if you want more Unleashed or more Reflex or more whatever, and I'll, or more Supercross even, and I'll try to accommodate that. But this is Red Bull Supercross Round 1, and I'm taking a break from all the freestyle tracks to take a look at a racing track, and I've actually just had a decent amount of fun. This nice little racing track right here. It looks pretty pretty. looks pretty. And it flows pretty. I hate saying flow because you can't really quantify flow. Yeah, try, quantify flow. Try and do that, and then I'll use the word flow more. But it's, it's just, it rides pretty smoothly, and it looks pretty. And I don't know. I just it's one of those racing tracks where I just can kind of put laps on it all day long and not really get too bored of it. And I don't know. I just liked it as I eat shit on the whip there. And there's also a big step up thing right there. I'll take a look at that in a minute. I should do that right now before I get too lost, so I'll make my way over there, because I don't think these tough blocks actually reset and replace themselves once you hit them off, so I'm going to try not to hit too many of them as I make my way over there. And cut across two lanes of traffic. Yeah, I'm fine. Alright, there we go. That's how you do it. And just one more hop out, and we're good to go now. We'll take, we'll take a look at this big step up thing, which I'm not sure how possible this really is to clear, even on the big old 500 I couldn't make it over, but I'm just on the 250 right now, because I think these 250s look cooler. The big 500 does, especially the Suzuki one. So here we go. We'll take a crack at this, and not even close. Nice big drop down. These ramps are actually really nice ramps too. They're like nice and big, and yeah, nice little miniature free style thing over here. Just to have a little bit of fun. So taking a break from stuff. I'll hit these jumps once each, probably. Yay! We missed that jump. We'll have to turn back around and try again. Nice little turn down. Let's throw that. There we go. And just do a nice little tail whip over here if I can remember which thing is that. There we go. Let's do a double tail whip. Fuck that. Nailed it. Awesome. And jump all the way back across the track. And let's hop back on track right about here. I'm feeling just trying to hit any tough blocks. All right. There we go. Now we're on the track. Now we're actually focused on trying to do some laps here. Uh, it's this. It's just a fun track. It would have the AI on and be racing them, except the AI just is not like. If you think if you thought the AI was bad with custom tracks and reflex, you've not seen anything. It's just awful on custom tracks here. And the AI itself is not really that hard to ever beat in this game. So you can just kind of reload over everything because it's unleashed. And let's launch into the whoops here. There we go. And nice. This track is it just rides really nicely. I like it. Step off and just some whoops up. I guess that's some dragons back. Maybe I don't know what to call that. You gotta preload that to clear the triple, which I forgot to do. And I'm gonna get. The only thing it's like if you crash, you get reset either to this little freestyle area here, or you get reset back to the starting gate if you crash on the track somewhere. Which I'm not sure how I feel about that. Because if you crash somewhere on the track for during a lap, you've got to like redo the entire thing. And I think I'm going backwards right now, so we're gonna turn around up here. I like this nice little like step off triple triple. Which you can not really quad that. I thought I thought there was something there quad over, but there's not. It's a nice deep whoops right here. You get the back end washing out if you're not careful. These turns are actually kind of hard to get to to get the turn right, so you don't launch yourself off the track when you go off the turn. And it's still just double out right there. Another big turn. Like if you, it's hard to get these turns like exactly 90 degrees so you don't fling yourself way off the track when you come around the turn here. Which is, I guess, that's a good thing. It's challenging. Some nice Air Force tough blocks. We're going to case this double. I'm going to try and clear that. That's just not meant to happen. Around that. Ooh, we're going to case that as well. It's okay though. We should be able to get some power down. Hopefully. Nah, I can never really get full preloads in this anymore. Like, I, don't, I, have, I just have issues hitting for the full preload now, which is kind of stupid, but... You, have, you just have to time the preloading right, and you'll be able to get full like that. I can't really tell exactly what kind of rhythm you're supposed to get here, because like, I always end up, I usually end up singling out right here, and that's... I feel like that's not fast, but hey, what am I going to do? You can almost quad right there if you nets rail that turn perfectly. Nice little double there to get on, step off, and do some whoops. Around the burn. Step on, step off, and we can kind of preload this and try and triple out. If you get a full preload there, you will be able to triple. You can almost like double that, and then sort of, I don't know, just double that. You don't want to end up singling there because you have to slow up a lot. See if lap times even matter in Unleashed anymore. So triple down, thank you. Big Honda, oops, I always kind of preload here. Try and see how many I can fly over, but I don't have to, I'm an unleash, the back end can get a bit sideways in some whoops now, it's kind of cool. Can almost quad that, but not quite this time. Try and triple single, I guess, but I kind of failed the triple. So we're gonna set the 
sort of half-assed double out there, and then step on here, double down, and single out. Ground and burn. Step on, step off, not quite. If you, you, you do that just right, you can kind of double there, and it goes pretty quick if you do it right, but I did not do that right, unfortunately, and I am back at the freestyle section again, god damn it. I just kind of cut back on here through the Dunlop things, hopefully that tough block doesn't stay in the way of the track. A little half preload there, you can double that, and hopefully triple out, not quite, if you do it just right, you can triple out there, and it's pretty fast. Let's try this again, step on, step off, double, thank you. That's how you're supposed to hit that. Oh, whoa, that was, a, that was an interesting way to land that right there. Let's try that again through here. You just get reset in bad spots on this track, which is a minor issue. Never quite double that, actually. Maybe it should change your mind. Maybe you can double there. Step on, step off, minor preload, and you gotta get at least like half preload to double that. Jump to here. Double, you can almost double over that, then step onto the tabletop off of that, but I screwed that up. So I'm trying to launch across the track here to get back in place. Stupid tough blocks. They look pretty, but they're in the way. Haha. <laughs> These tough blocks do look really pretty, I gotta say. So, try this again. Double here. Nice. Oh, I can get the preload in there. God damn it. Never quite launch all the way to the downside of that idea if you get the full preload for that, which I have issues doing. Back across the main straight, around that berm, double, thank you. Step on. I don't know what you're supposed to do. Maybe you're supposed to hit the brakes and then there's a little downslope I can see right there a bit, but yeah, either way, I always end up just singling out of here. Never quite get a smooth line into that corner. Triple, double, step on. And step off into the whoops. We're on this berm, tap the clutch a bit, maybe step on, step off. Roll that. Try and get a full preload to triple out. That's the fast line. Oh, that's not the fast line right there. That is not what you want to do. You want to just not preload right there. Step up to here, around the corner, step down, full power, triple. Don't go off the track, please. And the Honda whoop section, which you can just kind of preload over if you can. Feel that you lean back and keep on the throttle. Try and quad that. Maybe not quite. Double, double out, I guess. That works. Drop that berm. Let's throw a little whip over that. There we go. We're, we're fine. We're fine. Now, this section's a tough bit. Right here, you gotta get this corner just right. Just right, full preload, so I hopefully make it. Nice. Get a half preload in there. Full preload there to step over. Thank you. And you got it double on correctly, but it's throw a whip there for the hell of it. Single out, and I guess I'll do one more lap here. I think you guys have gotten the idea. I just have fun with this track, and I can go on for a long time turning laps here and not get bored. Hope maybe it's boring, you guys. I I don't know. And throw a nice little whip over there in case that one. That's okay though. We'll just kind of turn around right here. And launch into the whoops. Little three pack of whoops right there to nail. Tap the clutch, step on, step off. Some more whoops. Hopefully, we can get a good preload and triple. Maybe not. And step over, double up. Thank you. Nice berm right there. And again, it's gonna roll off this thing. Not really preload anywhere, just triple down. Try and reel that burn to keep as much speed. Preload over as many of the whoops as you can so you just lose speed in these whoops. Try and quad right here if you can. You get lucky. Nice. And then you can kind of just double double there. Oh, that is not how you want to turn, but that's actually that's the fast line right there. That is the fastest way through that section you will ever be able to hit. And should we get a full preload over here? Actually, nope, not quite. And that's pretty much going to do it for this video. Thank you guys all very much for watching. Let me know if you want more of Supercross or Reflex or Unleashed or what you guys want to see. And I guess I'll see you guys later. So thanks for watching and stay sexy. i got to try and get a back in here somewhere. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys later.